I'm going live. Good morning, you guys. Today is Sunny Liang Sunday. Actually, you know what? I'm always talking my vlog voice. This is the real me. What's up, bitches? Just kidding. What's up, angels? Today is Sandy Liang Sunday. It means that we are getting ready right now because the show is in three hours. Am I getting ready for the show right now? No. I'm getting ready for a little pop-up and then I have the Kim show. So definitely very thoughtful and intentional, which is what I've kind of been focusing on this year. And I'm not trying to exert my energy onto everything just because I can. But that's been my fashion week and now we're getting ready. I'm gonna do just like a really dewy, glowy, giving natural features because I never do too much. I was birthed to be demure, but I am actually chaotic. Makeup is done. Very simple. Mascara, tint, blush, eyebrows. Hi. Oh my gosh, this is so nice. Yeah, so the small bag is for you. Uh, you can bring samples with you throughout the day. Yeah, thank you. There's a little mirror here. So I'm gonna use this Merit Bomb to touch up. I'm gonna use this brow pomade next. Okay guys, so because I have the driver, I was like, do you mind if I pick up my groceries? <laughs> so I'm at the grocery store before the Sandy show. This really shows that I'd be, I'd be just doing whatever I want during Fashion Week. It's really chaotic, but I'm actually making chicken foie gras broth because my boyfriend and I haven't been feeling that well, so I need to nourish myself for lunch. I'm boiling the chicken broth with some spices and green onion and I'm gonna put this charred veggies. I also have my vermicelli you gotta boil and I have my rotisserie chicken there. Oh. I'm now headed to pick up Rumi and this is my outfit for the show. It's a little sweater vest and this is a skirt pant that I think is really cute for fall. Classic flats and I'm styling it with my own jacket and also their pin. Oh by the way it's also usually only about 20 minutes. People are always surprised because they think shows are an hour but they're like 15 to 20 minutes. They just end up starting 15 to 20 minutes later unless they're really on time and then it's like another 20 minutes spent taking photos afterwards. So that ends up being an hour but the show itself is like 15 to 20 only. But definitely feel like I'm expressing myself more and more each fashion week versus just wearing the brand's clothes as is before I kind of felt anxious that I had to just wear them the way that it was designed but now I'm actually styling it and expressing myself which is kind of the point of fashion week. collab and I love hey tea and this is the madness outside the show but I literally just had to get the tea I'm on my way to the Kim Shui show and I only have a lip gloss with me because I forgot to bring a purse so and then I just did my hair this is the look Okay, like 20 seconds to talk before I come down. I was supposed to have my rental appointment 
today at 10 a.m. and I'm late and I feel horrible to come back. Luckily, they're so understanding. My fashion week is so hectic, so this was kind of like on the other side of town for me. You wanna be in it? Yeah, should I? Yeah, should I you're the that? owner. No, I always highlight AIPI. <laughs> it's just, I hope that doesn't sound cheesy. <laughs> yeah, literally. <laughs> Yeah, the sandy style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I yeah. love that color. Reunited. Just met up. Our Ubers got here at the exact same time. Oh. Okay. Oh, she's dressed for the part. Jenny Pick. Matic Bolt hair. Okay. Gentle Monster. The same time, yeah, right? Yeah, so you guys are here. I will do the matcha. Sure. Studio, which I didn't expect. I'm gonna answer a clip. It just says content is 12:30 to 6. So, guys, it's only 2:30, but with all the socializing today, I'm pretty fucking tired. First one. So extra. This is just people who don't want to walk down the ramp, which is hilarious. It's a free ride. I'm gonna take it. Oh, I like this. Jacobs. That's the last stop of the night, but we're going to a Miu Miu event first, and then Vogue, and then a dinner, and then finishing off. I just made it easier for myself. I'm just gonna wear the look throughout instead of having to go home and change. Finally reunited. Okay, good person. Now we're reunited at the dinner. <laughs> I'm hungry. You know what? I only ate some charcuterie today, and then I cried because I was so hungry. And there was just no time. Seriously, don't. It's like non-consensual, like ripping food. <laughs> Lucy didn't want to know. Very concentrated. That's how you want it. for the coach show in a couple hours. I'm gonna take some photos of my outfit before 
before. Honestly, it's very casual. I look back on my outfit last year and I don't know why I hate it so much, but I think it's because I was just trying to do the most because when you get to the scene, there's like a bunch of photographers who take pictures of your outfit. So like the more crazy and unique it is, the more attention you get. But I really could care less, I guess, about the photo ops because I don't know, like sometimes it feels a bit off-putting because they'll like ignore you if your outfit's not crazy, but I really like how practical my look is for the coach show because obviously it's something that I would wear. And I pulled from my friend Tay to wear as an undershirt. I think what I really learned about living in New York is that you really just make it your own. So yeah, I'm gonna be doing that. Then I have a show tonight. I think it'll be over. For Isabel, right? Just tripped. I'm on my way to the coach show. Decorated my purse and I'm wearing some red flats. And I got my makeup done by this baddie, Asian American makeup artist. Yeah, she did a really good job. I'm her only client and she also only does makeup for one person and only knows one skill. If you know my reference, it's the me as a private client for myself as my own makeup artist. I am the makeup artist. <laughs> I just did this on a whim. And then I'm also gonna wear my Gentle Monsters. I added my own little charms. So I can just walk in with swag because I'm really awkward in front of the photographers. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm a coach right now in an hour and then I have to go home, get ready, eat and chill before I have Tory Burch tonight. I'm going live. Say hi guys. Perfect. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you so much. And this is vegan. Oh, wow. Okay, I'll just do this one. Thank you. <laughs> Look at you at the coach show now. She's Hannah Montana. You're Hannah Montana. I'm with the girls. Hi, vloggy vlog. We're sat in our trenches. I know, yeah. trench gang. Trench gang. Ready, ready for the show. We have the view. <laughs> Today is one of my favorite days because even though I have back-to-back -back shows, I'm updating the vlog consistently. And thank God I made my pho broth before the Sandy show because I am so hungry. I have to be ready in an hour for the Tory Burch show and I haven't eaten all day, which is very rare for me. Like it's not on my behalf that I can't eat. Like there's literally no time and there's no food at the places except at the coach show there was caviar on chip potato chips. That hit the spot, but I only got to eat like two of them. Such an amazing show. I will be wearing sneakers with satin dresses and leather caps. Also, I love the blown up makeup vanity bags. It's definitely making a comeback. I mean, whether you like it or not, wedge sneakers are coming back because Isabel Morant is an example of those like edgy it girl sneaks. And I haven't seen them around, especially in New York. Okay, let's make my dinner. I have to be ready and pick up Ruby at 6.30 and it's 6.10, so I'm gonna eat. I really ate with this. I'm gonna feel ready for the next show. Okay, y'all, I think the show is water themed, so I'm trying to do like a wet hair look. Bear with me. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm using the new Fenty hair that I got at the appointment the other day and it's actually saving my life because I had no product. But I think I just have to put a bunch of gel to make it look wet. Don't roast me. I think honestly the pressure of everything just makes me not think things through. Oh no, that looks wet. Okay, slay. Wait, I kind of ate with that. <laughs> I'm just gonna go like this. Office Tory Burch, I kind of look like an aquamarine trash bag, but you know, it's the look that I have. <laughs> I'm more the earrings. Most recent collection. Okay guys, I'm ready to go. I think I made this look work. It's like off the shoulder. And I did like this really iridescent makeup and I'm using this super glittery lippy. But yeah, I put a lot of highlight on my lips. Hee <laughs> hee. Ruby. And we're gonna go straight. 
straight to the show, bumped into people in the elevator, and it was very awkward because they're like, what the fuck are you wearing? Look at Ruby's outfit. She looks so cute. I love this. It's so cute. I would look like a condom if I wore it. But you look cute. They oh, and the tights. Like an so orange. good. Issa is giving eco sustainability Mother Earth. Yes. You're in. No, no, you're in. It's just a video though. <laughs> Finally home. I actually got a lot of compliments on this highlight situation. So if anyone's curious, my palette is from Sleek and I might be two years old or four years old, <laughs> might be. But I loved, loved, loved the show. I could see myself wearing a lot of the things, the ruffle skirts, the sweater vests, the beautiful asymmetrical dresses, the fortune cookie bags, everything is so, so cute. Honestly, I think that was probably my favorite show. Everything is tied with second and like Tori was like a smidge first not not to be biased but such different vibes with every show we had sandy which was giving totally spies in a corporate way we had coach that was giving classic new york with little new york i heart new york motifs and then we had tori which is so classy and giving kind of like futuristic chic kim is always classic with like a little bit of a party edgy sexy scandalous vibe so all really fun shows and i'm so so thankful that this is like a consistent time that i've been attending because every time I enjoy it so much and like it just really makes my fashion week and obviously thanks to you guys for supporting and just know that these are my favorite shows I just felt like I wanted to stay true to the shows and the designers that I actually really love versus just going to a show for the sake of it and just to show that I was there yeah I really enjoyed it and hope you guys enjoy this vlog sorry it's so chaotic I had a really chaotic week I think I'm coming on with a cold I have to eat more food drink more soup drink water you're minor drink water get rest that was a mouthful but i will see you in the next vlog